hello welcome back to my channel glory to jesus honor to mary and joseph thank you to all my returning subscribers and if you are new to this channel please click the subscribe button what it is like to be a catholic priest in qatar when father tabel mana needs to acquire altar wine for mass he must use a special card issued by the government of qatar are the only venue that sells alcohol to residents of the country. The 2022 FIFA World Cup Stadium beer bar eked many soccer fans who traveled to the Arabian Peninsula for the international sporting event. But Qatar's alcohol law are just a minor restriction compared with what Catholic priests face ministering in the Muslim majority country where public displays of Christian religion are forbidden. Father Mana has lived in Qatar for nine years. Originally from Lebanon, he ministers at Marionite Catholics living in Qatar, as well as Italian and French-speaking communities at the Church of Our Lady of the Rosary in Doha. He said that there are no bells or crosses on church buildings in Qatar. It is not possible to preach or grant the sacrament of baptism to the descendants of non-Christians or to convert from one religion to another, Mana said. He added that churches are considered embassies that deal with the ministry of foreign affairs. You can imagine that. Religious processions are only allowed to take place within the walls of the Qatar religious complex. A complex opened in 2008 that holds six different churches Roman Catholic, Anglican, Syrian Orthodox, Greek Orthodox, Coptic Orthodox, and an interdenominational group for Indian expatriate Christian communities. Copies of the Bible can only be distributed inside the church complex campus, Mana said. Father Mana celebrating the Divine Liturgy in Our Lady of the Rosary Church, Qatar. On the other hand, the priest noted that he has not faced any censorship in his homilies and is free to go out to minister to Catholics in Qatar, many of whom are foreign workers. We give Eucharistic communion to patients in hospitals without any problem. And we can pray in cemeteries as there are tombs for non-Muslims, he said. We also have every liberty to preach. No one ever interfered with my sermons. We recite our spiritual words without restrictions, he added. When it comes to marriages, however, the priest is only allowed to celebrate a wedding between two Christians, he said. If a Christian wants to marry a Muslim, they cannot get married in our church. We usually invite them to marry in another country. This is unbelievable. The Apostolic Vicariate of Northern Arabia estimates that about 200,000 to 300,000 Catholics live in Qatar. All are migrant workers, mainly from the Philippines and India. According to the vicariate, employment and camp rules can make participation in Catholic liturgies impossible for some of these workers. The Catholic community also struggles with restrictions on the number of priests allowed in the country and the limited capacity of each church inside the religious complex. Mana is currently overseeing the construction of a new Catholic church in Qatar, a Marionite Catholic church that will have a capacity of 1,500 people. Qatar provided land on which we can build today a church in the name of St. Chabel, he said. Cardinal Bachara Butros Rai the Marionite Catholic Patriarch laid the foundation stone for the church in 2018 at the invitation of the Qatar's Emir, Tamin 
been Hamad Al Tanin. The church is in the process of being finished, Mana said. Being a priest in the smallest country to ever host the World Cup also comes with some perks. Mana was able to attend the opening match of the soccer tournament along with other Christian leaders who minister in the Qatar religious complex. We sat near the seats designated for the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and church representatives we are wearing pectoral crosses without any problem, he said. You can see the church building that they are building that will contain 1,500 people and is almost completed. Mana is currently overseeing the construction of this new Catholic church in Qatar. It is a Marianite Catholic church with a capacity of 1,500 people. You can imagine what Catholics face in other countries. That when a Catholic, a Christian wants to marry a Muslim, you don't wed them in Qatar. Otherwise, they will go outside Qatar to do their wedding. We pray for all the priests working in Qatar that God will continue to strengthen them as they propagate Christ's kingdom on earth. Thank you very much for listening. Ave Maria.